In this video, I'll be talking about the top 10 digital marketing tools to promote your business or your website. Um, one of the first and most important tools that many advertisers are using is Google AdWords. It's the number one advertising PPC platform and it's easy to set up and within minutes you can start receiving visitors and customers to your website. Now Google AdWords is, as, as a PPC platform, it charges you based on every click that comes through your website, whether that's through the search network or the display network. Uh, the second tool that's worth using for your promotional tactics is Twitter. Now Twitter is great because it's got hundreds of millions of accounts and people who use it on a day-to-day -day basis and it is great for sending out news information uh, or anything that's related to your business that you want to promote to your target audiences and there are many tools that you can use to automate many other processes and make it easier for yourself and Hootsuite is one of them and it's very effective at scheduling and retweeting many of the important things that you want to send out to your followers. Uh, the next tool is Bing Ads. Now Bing Ads is very similar to Google AdWords in that um, it's a PPC platform, functions in the very same way as Google AdWords and one of its compelling features is that you do not have to create all campaigns and ads from scratch, especially if you already have an AdWords account because you can import those into Bing. So it's a great platform, however, far less traffic than Google AdWords and I believe estimates are about 13% amongst uh, countries where it is available. The fourth tool is SurveyMonkey. Now I like this tool because it's a great research tool and you can easily create surveys and find out the needs and wants of your customers and your website visitors and you can send these by email or upload it to your own website and get responses that way. It's got a free version and with that you're limited to 100 responses but that should be sufficient for many uh, businesses to survey their target audiences. The fifth tool is the Word Tracker Keyword Research Tool. Now this tool is advanced and has many features beyond what you'd get from the Google Keyword Planner. It's not free, there's a monthly subscription charge. The minimum is $27 per month, but with that you get many resources and it allows you to build niches, especially if you're into affiliate marketing and creating sites that promote products that you can sell and earn a commission for. The next tool is Alexa and Alexa is good because it is a competitor tool and you can quickly see uh, what your competitors are doing and how they are performing on key metrics um, like time on site, uh, bounce rate and which are the top uh, keyword searches in the organic results. So for competitive benchmarking, Alexa is one of the top tools. Uh, the seventh tool is Hootsuite. Now Hootsuite is one that I mentioned earlier as I was talking about Twitter. The nice thing about Hootsuite is that you can schedule many of your tweets. You can um, look at your mentions and respond to people. And you can add as many accounts in there as you like and promote uh, across your social network accounts. So that's LinkedIn, Google+, uh, Twitter, and so on. And it's got a nice interface, and you can see all the important things in just that one stream that you create for your account. Um, the next tool is MailWords. Now, this tool is great for pay-per-click advertising because you can quickly build large keyword volumes with um, this tool just by entering them in the three boxes as you can see or even start with two 
and build a long list of keywords that you can separate into your ad groups and then create your campaigns in, in, in your AdWords account and your Bing ads as well and um, target the long tail keywords which generally have better conversion rates. The ninth tool is Google Analytics. Now Google Analytics is um, a reporting and tracking tool and it's got many many great features including conversion tracking, call tracking, um, you've got more advanced features like multi-channel funnels so you can see what channels people are using to get to your site and then purchase and with that information you are sort of empowered in your budget setting in promotions on various channels and you can eliminate any channels that are not bringing you any returns and there's a lot of metrics in there that you need to keep an eye on like your bounce rates pages per session and sessions and so on and you can segment your data and gain greater insights into how people are using your website and last but not least is YouTube. YouTube is now the second last largest search engine uh, and is catching up fast with Google search so for raising brand awareness uh, getting people to know about your business and demonstrating your products and services a uh, video is definitely a must for any business that wants to do that and YouTube which with its huge volume is a channel and tool that you want to promote your business thanks for watching this video and Please comment and subscribe and I'll see you on the next video.